I told you I had nothing to worry about. As long as you had, all you had to do was make sure them checks clear and keep your mouth shut, I don't get paid this kind of money to lose. Look, I gotta go. Try lay low, man. I'm not sure how much more shit I can get you out of. Have you seen the news? Like you are everywhere. But once again, pissing off some people. Now you know Troy should have been put behind bars. Well, you know I'm gonna damn about what people are saying. As long as they talk and they're gonna be paying me in the future. But you don't care. But all this whispering and cold stares, hell, it was like I was on trial. I mean, I won. He's a free man. It's only a matter of time before I'm behind that bench. Before long, I'm going to run this city. <laughs> you mean we are running the city? I'm still behind you, beside you, besides. <laughs> behind every strong man is a stronger woman. And who the hell is that? You'll put your own mother under the bus with you. Just to be on top. you damn right. And trust me, she's not the only one. I mean, would you have some class for once? Go ahead. Max. And who's that, Max? Don't worry about it. Well, why don't you go play with your toys? I'm pretty sure he can cool you off before it's time to go to work. Are you serious? Max! Please go. I can't believe it. Hey, what's up? Sorry about that. I had to handle some things. I've been thinking about you. Different flavors, but I like mine hot and sweet. What's your choice? Reaches for Angelica while gazing into her mm, dark, illustrious brown eyes. Mm. He pulls her into the shower towards him vigorously. Mm. His strong, robust arms squeeze tight around her dainty waist as she tries to resist. Mm. Exposure. 
First of all, that girl's name is Bridget, and she is missing. Compassion, you want to get you some? Mm. Dang. You know what, where is Ma? I went to her office to try to give her her mail, and she wasn't in there. Have you seen her? Where is she? No, and I've been calling everywhere, even the morgue. Hopefully she'll turn up as a Jane Doe, but nothing. I mean, a girl can dream, right? Girl, you need to sit down somewhere. I don't know what's wrong with you. You know, joking like that is not good for your soul. <laughs> Who said I was joking? You are a hot dad gone mess. How you gonna talk about that girl like that? I've been out there, so hey, you know, know where she's at. Out there? Mmm, mm. look at you. And you talking. Mm -hmm. Speaking of out there, how's your husband doing? We are doing fine, thank you. Oh, that's good. That's why you're not wearing your ring today? Um, <laughs> no, I'm getting it fixed. Okay. Nothing. Give me this book so you can get some work done. Bless her, Lord. Bless her. Hi, Mama. Guess what? Oh, you will not believe who I'm about to meet. The fabulous and gorgeous Lydia David. Ooh, Lydia David. Yes, Mama, I know. Ooh, Mama. Mama. Mama, no, Ma, you cannot come. Bye. Mag, this is Laura. I'm trying to reach you. Where are you? What's going on? I'm trying to reach you. I just left the gym. I'm almost at the house. All right, call me. Quickly. Bye, babe. Yeah. 